bloodthirsty when the doors put their paws on. You go tell a medic go with little bigger claws on. I'm the general. We thought Valorant Mobile will hit the Play Store first, but the Rainbow Six Mobile have done it. As a hardcore right fan, I am very much disappointed over the Riot Games. Why is the Valorant? But the good news is, the Rainbow Six Siege is considered one of the best titles regarding strategic warfare and heartbeat inducing gameplay. Players getting incredibly creative with the many ways to attack or defend a site. Couple all that with insta kill shots. It feels like you are there physically, fighting for your hostage life. And the addition of the mobile version, I mean the Rainbow Six Mobile, took it on another place. Like, today we'll learn more about this new upcoming Rainbow Six Mobile. Before we start, if you love FPS game, make sure you stay with the channel for more of the Rainbow Six or Valorant actions. At first glance, many people might see Rainbow Six Mobile and think it looks incredibly similar to the Sage, which is excellent. This game alpha version seemed looked pretty good and it looked like the game was quite close to being complete or at least suitable for a global release with some additions. It could be possible that uh, now Ubisoft could uh, preparing a roll it out so that we can finally have a new AAA title but uh, they have done it like as the pre-registration is ongoing for the Rainbow Six Mobile. The mobile requirements for this version of Rainbow Six is have not been revealed yet but uh, we will likely guessing the similarity of the other popular fps games like call of duty and uh, the we're not uh, talking about pubg mobile or free fire these are kind of low quality but uh, at least they need uh, 2 gb of ram on ios and the android version so we are thinking this will be something like this or the ios version over 9.0 and android version over 5.1 and up to so this could be the requirement for the mobile device whatever you are using at its heart rainbow six mobile is a competitive and tactical fps game with uh, two teams of five versus five attackers and defenders also the core gameplay character maps have some similarities with the siege the game is being developed by ubisoft themselves and it seems to be a full-blown recreation of the original one just to scale down to work on a mobile device. It was one of the most exciting announcement for this year and really gave mobile gamers something to look forward to. But uh, there was another big announcement of the mobile territory like the Valorant mobile. But we don't know what is happening or where it is. But as I am a big hardcore rat fan and uh, I am really disappointed about it as we need more of the Valent mobile actions like more info or trailer trailers or whatever you say but what is this i mean is this Valorant dead i think for the mobile version it is dead as no updates for so long but uh, this is a very good news for the fps lover that uh, the early registration or the pre-registration for the rainbow six mobile is on just make sure you have done it because it will be one of the most coolest fps game made by Ubisoft so don't miss it guys as the game has been developed for the past three years and uh, is the mobile version of the Ubisoft famous PC console titled Rainbow Six Siege a 5 vs 5 game that is still a part of the Tom Clancy Rainbow Six series the first title of the series was released in 1998 for the console user but I really think this one I mean the mobile version will be another big success from them but I'm still thinking about what rioters are doing. I mean, what are they doing actually? I think they are balancing the games as they do always. And I think so. Uh, we need much more update about the Valorant Mobile. I think they will give us much and more update very soon. And yeah, that's something for you guys. Hope you all love the content. But if you're new, make sure you stay with the channel and see you all soon. Till then, have fun, good luck, and peace.